Some of you may have seen them a little bit, but I think most of you haven't looked at them yet. What do you think happened? Um, Keep in mind what we did to begin with, right? We took a Q-tip. Yeah. You were given an object. Something. Something in this golf's. You rub a Q-tip on the object and you put it onto the agar tray, right? Mm -hmm. Now, could you see anything on the tray as of Wednesday? Could you see bacteria or any type of germs on well, the tray I when you could. left? That's what I, mean. I could. You could see and bacteria. I didn't even use my legs. Yeah, you I could see that. Now, remember what I told you, the agar has nutrients in it, which should allow the bacteria, which you can't see bacteria by themselves, but it should have allowed them to grow. And if enough of them grew and created what we call a colony, it should be big enough to see, right? Um, now remember, y'all did two trays. First tray, you just got a sample of whatever your object was. What did we do before we did the second tray? We got a clean Q-tip. Clean Q-tip, and then you did what to your object? Rubbed yeah, rubbed it with alcohol, which should have killed anything, right? Mm -hmm. Now, does that mean that there wasn't something floating in the air that could have fallen on it? It could have still, you could still have stuff on your clean tray. Just because you cleaned the keys or you cleaned the uh, glasses or the computer or whatever, you could, you should still have something on it because there's probably stuff floating around in the air that you just can't do anything about. Um, but should you have as much growth on the clean tray as you had on the one that you didn't clean? No, it shouldn't have as much growth, right? All right, I'm going to set these in front of you. We're going to look at both of them. Uh, don't touch them. We're just going to look at them. Who had the computer? Mm -hmm. I had the glass. Oh, that is weird. Right, How's it look, Megan? I would That's never use lot. it again. Good never use that computer again. <laughs> I ain't touching it. You had stuff on it. Right? Just throw it away. Yeah. I had mm -hmm. no touching it. Mm -hmm. So, well... Okay, well, I guess you're not touching the cell phone I have again. Keys. Don't touch them. So, this was the cell phone? Yep. Okay. And you're suggesting I never touch it again? Yeah, that's a little. Uh, well, you cleaned it and it looks a little better. Wow. But, you, but you know. All this happened in just a week. Look at all this. Look week. at so all this germs. Was any of that on there when we left last Wednesday? No. Nope. No. So obviously it grew from whatever was on your Q-tip that you put on that surface. It what grew do you think? from that. There's millions of them. Well, you cleaned them good. A hundred thousand mm -hmm. billion. Yeah, the glasses, trillion. he did a pretty good job. Look at the before he cleaned it. Mm -hmm. Now compared to the after. There are some growths on the one what? after. You got okay. a red job. I cleaned it way too good. But he obviously way did a pretty good. good job of cleaning it because... It's, you know, the, it's a lot less growth on the tray after he cleaned it, correct? Yeah. Um, same with you, the cell phone. You obviously did a good job, but the cell phone's easy to clean. It's a flat surface. Wow. It was very easy to clean. Look at all uh, The computer arms. was probably a lot harder to clean because the keys, you got to try to get down in between them, and so it's almost impossible to clean a keyboard as well as you could clean a cell phone. He is more and as a result, you can see there's definitely less growth here but it is uh, more growth than some of the other ones. Okay, um, remember what we were trying to take away from this. Just because you can't see bacteria or a virus on your hand, does that mean you shouldn't wash your hands? No. And remember, there can be things on your hand, even if your hands look extremely clean, it doesn't necessarily mean they are clean, right? And this proves it. Okay, you probably didn't think there was anything on the, that set of glasses or on those keys. You couldn't see anything, they looked relatively clean. Okay, we didn't realize how disgusting Everything she owns really is. Uh, Once like again, said, not nice. It doesn't take much time. A little bit of alcohol, which is what the hand sanitizer is made out of, is alcohol. A little bit of alcohol can go a long way in, in uh, killing <laughs> any type of bacteria or virus that may be. Don't harm. release the monster. Well, you said the. Uh -uh. We had two more also that y'all didn't go with us. This was a bathroom at one of the convenience stores. You see before, clean it and after, kind of the same thing. A lot less growth on this one. And this was a gas pump, which everybody uses gas pumps. We never, we don't think about them a lot, but this was before I cleaned it, and this was after. So once again, you can see there's less growth on the one after we cleaned it. Wow. Yeah. Just... Right, is everybody like going to wash their hands at least before you eat? 